Hey guys, Brian delivers you the goods here. I'm returning to you, surprisingly, tonight for a track review that I said I was going to do. And this is for Foo Fighters' new song, Shame Shame, that I just got done listening to. So I'm going to discuss what I listened to for this track and let you know my thoughts on it. So let's dive into this review. Now, what I think of this song overall... It's boring as fuck. It's just... Ugh. Words can't describe how I really feel about it. I think it's just shit. And it's... It just follows the same pattern. With the same melody, the same uh, pacing of the song. is just sounding the same. And it's got no different uh changes in the song doesn't have a bridge doesn't have a fucking uh well it has the chorus and some verses but nothing nothing good enough to make this song likable is what i'm trying to say they actually are releasing their new album medicine at midnight which is dropping uh, February 5th of 2021, which I'll, I'll probably review it. Um, I got to see what I'm doing next year for reviews because I know I'm going to be uh, busy next year doing other stuff, uh, real life stuff, like uh, personal things that I got to do for the new year, like moving, I guess, is one of them. And it's going to suck. But it's got to be done. Uh, yeah. Um, I think if I'm moving next year or something like that. I'm not sure. I'll keep you guys updated on what I'll be doing for the new year. For videos and all that. But uh, yeah. This single was just bad. Uh, no originality. No, what is it, spunk to make the song a lot better? It's just lazy. It's it's just a terrible lead single to even call it a lead single, I guess you could say. But it apparently made it as a lead single. And I'm like, ah, oh, fuck. This song is just horrible. Uh, it's just disappointing that... Dave Grohl has a good voice, and he has potential to make these songs better, but this song did not execute very well with how it was playing out where it goes, shame, shame, and then it goes into like a little bit of few liners. And then it goes back to the shame, shame part where he's singing it. And I'm just, hands down, this is just a terrible song. Overall, I think Shame, Shame by Foo Fighters was just bad. It, I don't see myself even downloading it at all. Because I fucking hate this song. Uh, if you guys liked it, that's fine. But this was, there are actual facts about what I mentioned about the song that I could call bad uh really off melody very lazy tempo of and the pacing of the song is is sounding the same it the song just sounds like it's going nowhere and it's it's a shame <laughs> of course shame shame what it's called but uh if you got the irony to what i was saying there <laughs> but overall out of five i'm gonna give this song a two out of five this was just bleh. this was terrible i don't see myself returning to this and nope I'm not gonna even download it but definitely comment below let me know what you guys thought of the new Foo Fighters track, Shame Shame, if you've heard it. And if you did like this track review, comment below and let me know your thoughts on it. 
tap a like on this video if you liked it. Subscribe to my channel if you can support the channel. I also got to mention the riffs in this song were sounding the same. And the drum work was not even that interesting, I should say. I was actually watching John from ARTV's review on it just to get a perspective on what I could say differently in this review. And, uh, yeah, this song was just not good. But I will be returning to you tomorrow for the Avril Lavigne final album review for her discography album reviews I've been reviewing since last Monday. It's ending tomorrow with the self-titled album with the unfortunate single Hello Kitty. And I'm like, oh god, I gotta review that. Uh, album with that song in it but it's a shame that uh Foo Fighters well it's it sucks that Foo Fighters just didn't do a good job making that single a great single and like I said it's a shame shame <laughs> if you got what I was trying to say there <laughs> uh but yeah um and I'll also be doing uh, ACDC's new album review, Power Up, on Thursday or Friday. It's going to be one of those days. I don't think I'm going to have a lot of albums to review for the month of November. I'm going to have some, but not a lot. Because uh, the new year's coming up very fast. And the end of the year videos are just around the corner. I just uh, finished my Worst Albums of 2020 video on Sunday if you want to go check that out. Because I think I did a good job on it. But I'm going to end this video here by saying thank you for watching this uh, Foo Fighters track review for Shame Shame. I hope you enjoyed it. Stay safe, take care, and I'll see you in my next video.